Hey everybody, this is Ben, and welcome back to another episode of Computer Craft Challenge. I am going to be trying something slightly different today, so I'll get to that in a moment. Uh, since the last time, I uh, just finished getting all my GPS computers up into the sky. There, you can kind of make them out, maybe, against the stars. And uh, I've, I did just a brief test here, did a GPS locate, uh, opened up its modem, and yeah, it found all those computers way up in the sky and correctly identified its position. 252, 239, 68. So you can see, uh, you can see over, whoop, over on the main map side there, 252, 239. And when I hop down next to it, it's still, the foot position is still 68. It gets confused when I stand on top of here, but yeah, 68. So yeah, it's correct position. GPS seems to be functioning correctly. So woohoo. That means we are ready to do some slightly more uh, advanced turtle programming, which I will admit is going to be a new thing for me. I've not bothered really with GPS and coordinates and, and worrying about all that stuff automatically before. So this is going to be, you know, some new territory for me to cover, but I'm excited about it because it should allow me to have a much more powerful automated system. So the new thing that I am going to get to, which uh, double check if this is going to work um, is that I'm recording in a slightly different fashion. Oh, and there's a little bug around my avatar there. Weird. Anyway, such that you should be able to see this. I am going to be doing some editing outside of Minecraft. And you can see here I've already navigated to the Computercraft Lua ROM APIs Turtle directory here um, in my modded my computer modded computer craft directory and that is so that I can begin working on my custom turtle API uh, such that I, I will be able to a lot be a lot easier to keep track of things like location and stuff like that that it'll automatically keep track and I'm still trying to kind of in my head figure out how exactly how how autonomous I want to make the turtles that if I am going to hmm I think I might be <clears throat> excuse me I think I might be moving my console up onto the surface here um, sometime soon anyway Oh, there, that's a good view. You can see all the, the computers and, of course, all the extra blocks that got up there during testing. Um, so move my console up here in order to... Uh, I, th I should move all up to the <laughs> sky limit, I guess. Um, but anyway, I want to have the console. Let me spit this out. Come on, Ben. Um, to send information to all of my turtles. Things like where you know the coordinates for basic for certain things like coordinates for a drop-off point, Turtle would send a request, and the console, the main you know main console would then reply back. You Turtle would you know request drop-off or something like that, and then the, the console would send back saying drop-off at you know these coordinates. And I also have to code something into the API to track which direction the turtle is facing, um, which yeah yeah that sh that should be quite doable. Um, so, so yeah, that's that's kind of a, a very very long term look at my plans actually right now. Um, for now, I mean, I'm still, as you can see in the ground here, still on the quest for diamonds. I really didn't want to have to like dig down there, have my turtle dig me a mine and all that. That I thought this would be fine. This would be much easier, right? But so far, it's not. But at any rate, so this is going to be fuel zero. What are we at? 472. Not bad. <laughs> um, I may have jumped the gun just slightly working on the API because I need a little bit more room for a sidekick here to mine. So um, we're going to do... Oops. Go... <laughs> I should figure out how to write something to make him cut trees down better as well. But left turn forward, right turn forward, forward. And then we 
just log. Go ahead and cut that down. Oh, see, he's not even... Did I have an error? Oh, of course I did. Erp. I forgot he uses slot one as his identifying to identify the wood. Um, so why don't we just go ahead and edit the logging program? Um, fuel's not much a concern anymore, so I don't really care if he goes those couple of blocks higher into the tree. And I don't want to have to keep readjusting his inventory. So we can happily just come right on down here to the save file to computer number zero, which you can see here is Sidekick, and I have Notepad++ installed. And let's see here, text, where do I? Uh, oh, here we go, language, uh, Lua, there we go. Get some highlighting on here, how nice. So yeah, this is Notepad++, has highlighting. I got a couple of extra text plugins to do things like auto indent and stuff like that the way I wanted. So we check fuel function. Yeah, that's something else definitely gonna be API, of course. Forward while turtle dot detect up. Check fuel, dig up, turtle up, blah, blah, blah. So we go ahead and save that, and then, oh gosh, I, I gotta start pausing this now, actually, instead of just opening my inventory, I gotta, like, pause, or I am gonna die so fast, so, so fast. Okay, so, go back, and now if I tell him to log, actually, let me just edit log, you can see right down, right down here already, turtle dot detect up instead of compare up. So, exit log. Yeah, he, he doesn't care. He doesn't care what's going on. And he digs through the leaves, nothing else left. Yeah, that's fine. And of course, you know, he missed, he missed the one there. But I'm just gonna leave that, I don't care. Um, pu punching grass and snow isn't cheating, right? <laughs> I know Sidekick wouldn't like them. So, uh, one, two, three, four. Forward. Um, yeah, twice. Forward, right turn. One, two, three, four. Great, so now... Come on, sidekick. Log. Now, I don't necessarily need the wood here. I might be able to use it for something. But, go forward, forward. Log. Oops, a little bit of lag. Yeah, I'm not 100% I'm not sure how this uh, recording method is going to work out, but uh, I'm, I've set up for, you know, like a screen area instead of actually using the uh, di the DirectX interface on my recording. So that's how I can get stuff in front of my Minecraft. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, movement key got stuck there. Yeah, something. Something's going on. This feels pretty laggy. Seeds, yay. If I had a farmer, that would be nice. Mm hmm So why don't I cut down a few more trees and I'll cut, you know, cut the recording, cut down a few more trees and be right back. All right, we're back and you can see the space there that I got cleared out and, oh, I think I forgot to pick up the wood. Yep, I got a bunch of wood from Sidekick, so that's fun. You see all my manually entered commands there to just shuttle them around. Um, that's something that I'm, you know, I'm certainly going to have to think about once I have, uh, once I have that other second mythical mining turtle, I will definitely, I think I will definitely be moving this, uh, mining program into the, like, default, you know, shared directory for all turtles f from the specific save 
so that I don't have to add it to every turtle, and any turtle can mine. But uh, as per usual here, let's uh, get rid of that. Refuel zero, what you got? 220, that's fine. You got plenty with the coal that you have. Sidekick, so best of luck to ya. Go on mining run, yes. Commence mining. And off he goes, as per usual. Now one thing is, I should probably go down in my hidey hole there, because actually I'm realizing now that if I'm working on this API, I, I can't be, uh, can't be pausing the game. Or sidekick here won't be mining, and that's kind of the whole point. So I suppose what I should do, whoa, lag. Yeah, this, I got some lag spikes with this, but um, what I should do is probably just craft a door, right? That'll work, um, as, as long as I don't fall into some holes down here. There's lots of big holes everywhere. <laughs> Nerve wracking. All right, get unload all this. I got so much friggin' cobble. Definitely enough to build something. Saplings and all right. So let's make myself a door. Only what twenty six episodes? I think this will be twenty six episodes in, and look, I have a door. Um. And I am gonna quote unquote cheat here. Uh oh, zombie pal's coming. I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here. I know I saw him. Hmm. I saw him over this way before. Guess not. All right, he must be on the other side of my wall. So, let's get back in the hole. He must be in a cave, actually. And, uh, go ahead and just cheap ass door. Cheap, cheapest door you can pretty much have there. Block of dirt door. Yeah, let's, let's call that. Call that good, I suppose. Actually, I could have put it on the other block. Anyway.